WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished up 268, NASDAQ up 279, S&P's up 52, gold, gold down $23, trading out at 19.19 an ounce. Yet silver down 56 cents at $25.05. Light sweet crude up 179, 104.77, notes and bonds. The 10 year note up eight ticks, trading 124.19. The 30 year up a full point, plus three ticks at 152.17. Now, both of those basically hardly moved at all when you really look at the chart and they have light volume. Bonds, notes, they want lower price, high yield. King dollar, King dollar up 200, 233 ticks, trading out at 98,207. Euro 110, yen is out here at 113.13, and the British pound is at 131 to one US dollar. We get over and take a look at the SPY. What you have out here, folks, is that you, you're finishing at the highs of the day, and we want to take a look at this volume, and with the quad witching and with the indice um, uh, rebalancing, we, we, we'll get to get a little bit more volume. Okay, so the SPYs uh, end up, we got 91 million. Uh, the swing point has 105. You're over the swing. The swing's 441. That's telling me this uh, S&P wants to run up to this 458. We go into the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX. Now, the three Qs had the volume uh, as I started my show. And the bottom line is that uh, they got it. They basically took out a swing. They took it out with volume. You took out the swing of, uh, we had 71 million, you did 79 million, you had 350 was the swing, you did, did, you're at uh, 351. Man, this is going to be so deviant, folks, okay? Because my take is that this is a still a bear market, but this is how they work, man. The bottom line, you know, next area up, and this is the first time we did take out swings since the highs that were established in January. Bottom line, I see the Qs, 370 is game. So we get some action out here. Gold, gold contract pull back with light volume. You know, we went through the XAU, the HUI. They both won higher price. They both came into their swings last week. Monster volume. You take a look at the gold contract pull back with light volume out here today. We go look at the uh, dollar. The dollar looks to me like it is going higher. Okay, the bottom line, you're up 234. It's been consolidating out here. It's had... It's having an, a hard time holding price. That being said, in order for the dollar to you know, really get a lot lower, it has to go under 96.938. And right now, you're basically 100, uh, you're 17 ticks, 1,700 ticks above it. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Come back and visit Tommy Monday morning. Kicks us off 9 a.m. Have a great one, folks.